The normal probability is the most extensively used probability distribution. It has a symmetric bell-shaped distribution as seen in the diagram there. It is described by two parameter, the population mean and the population variance. And third, the normal distribution is asymptotic in the sense that the tail gets closer and closer to the horizontal axis but never touches it. Furthermore, as other probability distribution, the horizontal value contains the random variable denoted as x. Here, where the center is the mean value of the population. However, for normal probability distribution, the x is then transferred into the z value. That is why it is shown that the horizontal line here contains the z student value or the standard normal value. So this three is the characteristic of the normal probability distribution. The random variable is transformed into the standard normal value or written as z because later on we will see that to simplify on calculating the probability of a random variable, we transform the random variable into the z-score value, the alternative name for the standard normal value. Using the letter z to denote a variable with the standard normal distribution, we have the expected z equals to 0 and the standard deviation of c equals to 1 which means that the value z measures the number of standard deviation a given value is away from the mean. So what does this imply? So let's take an example. We have the mean equals to 18 and standard deviation equal to 2. When the mean is 18, the standard the z value is equal to zero a z score of one implies that the given value is one standard deviation above the mean or x is equal to 18 plus one standard deviation or 20. a z score of two implies that the given value is two standard devi deviation above the mean or 18 plus two times Two standard deviation, the standard deviation is 2, 18 plus 4 is 22. Similarly, a z score of minus 1.5 implies that the given value is 1.5 standard deviation below the mean or is 15.5.